Hello everyone. Today I'm going to show you how to do um, basic layers on Medibank on the phone. Um, so yeah, this is going to be very, very basic. Um, there's not going to be much to this. Just how to get into it and what I do. Um, I normally use the default on my phone. 25 by 25. There's not much to it on the phone. Yeah. Um, next week, I'm gonna show y'all how to do it on the computer. It's more... Normally when you're doing an illustration, you would normally do it on the computer or the tablet. I don't know. So, um, we're just gonna... I'm just gonna show you how to do it on the phone. Um, so when you wanna, like, rename it, you press the little gear. Um, I really don't know why I kept typing in a backspacing this right here <laughs> I guess I was just trying to show y'all yeah so then if you want to create a new layer press the plus sign I normally press just the color layer there's different other options different other options other <laughs> options um, but I normally just press color Um, yeah, um, then you press, so I'm just trying to show y'all, uh, press for the different types, um, I always press normal, multiply, or add, uh, depending on what program you're using, um, it could be glow or add, I, for Medibang is add, um, during this time, I was trying to find my G-Pin too. And I just couldn't find it at that time, so I was just gonna. I'm just gonna use the G pin. I don't. Yeah, I don't know why I couldn't find it. Um, to adjust it, I press Edit and different sizes and the opacity. And then um, I'm gonna just gonna create like a circle, and I create a really ugly circle. <laughs> uh, and I'm using my finger. I didn't have one of those. Um, don't judge me, it was, was those screen, pencil, tap, <laughs> um, I don't really use those, so I don't know what they're called, um, yeah, I was using my finger, <laughs> um, <laughs> so the next thing we're gonna do is I'm gonna press the gear, and then I'm going to rename it, and it helps me understand what layer it is. I mean, y'all don't have to rename it, but it does make it easier if you do rename it to what it is. Mm. And then I just use another color layer. Um, so I actually renamed Sketch also to Line Art because normally I'll do a sketch, then Line Art, or a sketch, then Rough Sketch, then Line Art, and then the base color underneath. But I'm just I just decided to do line art because it'd just be easier for me to understand what I was doing. So yeah, the and then I'm just picking a color to fill in, and then I press the brush in the top left corner, and then press the bucket, the paint bucket, and then just fill it in. And then I'm gonna go in. I'm. I'm just showing you how to press the gear to hold it, and you can move it around. Um, and then I move it back. I accidentally pressed it instead of holding it. And then I'm gonna add another color layer in between line art and base color on top of base color. And then add the clipping layer. And then I'm just gonna pick another color. And go back to brush tool. And. I really don't know what I was doing. I think I was trying to find a different color, a different brush. And it shows that you cannot go outside the filled color. Awesome. So, <laughs> um, I'm going to rename that and add it shade. Um, normally when I'm doing illustrations, I'll do, I'll name, I'll like kind of name all the layers as best I can because I'm always, you know, brushing. <laughs> Um, but sometimes when I'm doing base colors and the shading, I don't name them. <laughs> I don't know why, I just don't. 
Um, yeah, I'm just showing you the different types here. Um, after showing the different kinds here, that's pretty much all. And then I'm gonna show you what it looks like when you move the shade underneath the base, clo base color. goes behind it so that's pretty much it for this little bitty little bitty video i'm going to show you more on the computer to better understand but these are just different devices you can use and how to use on medibang normally if you're using any other kind of uh, program layer layers are pretty much the same um that's pretty much it for this video i hope y'all enjoyed it um Thank you guys so much for watching.